everyone and welcome back to The Walking Dead. So tonight we're going to be continuing the first episode where we left off in the last episode. So without further ado, we hope you all enjoy and we'll get straight into it. I hope you all enjoying the series <laughs> as much as I am, should I say. Right, so we are going. Right, so I had to try and figure out what I was doing. Right, I think I've talked to you. You all right, Lee? I'm okay. Thanks. There's no getting in there from out here. That grate does its job. The thing is, all right. I'll go outside, but you'll send me back in because I can't do anything. How are we doing? Good. Want to go have a look around outside? Let's have a look around. Okay. Because she won't allow me to do it. This is what I don't get one. Unless it'll let me now. Hey man, what are you doing? We can't See, even think about going out there unless the keys are out there for sure. They are out there. I can't reach that brick. I'll work on determining if that boy worked here. Sounds good. Right, I'm going to go back in. Like I say. Let's head back inside. Okay. Right, I'm going to go into that other room. I'm going to have a little dig around and have a look. Or... I wonder if I need to look at these photos. Alright, so you're only looking at them. I don't remember them very well. Right, let's go back in. Just wish I could move on to the next part. Uh, the keys are on that zombie out in the street. See, I can't even break it. <laughs> Shop. Keys it is, I guess. That's what I figured. Alright, okay. Then I do this part. It's a photo of the family who owned this place. It might help us track down the keys to the office. I know who you are. You're Lee Everett. You're a professor at Athens who killed a state senator who was sleeping with your wife. This is your parents' store. Folks around town know the owner's son got himself a life sentence, but I'm a reporter for WABE in Atlanta. I paid attention to that trial. Maybe you're a murderer, but I don't really care. Frankly, that's a skill that might come in handy. <laughs> Did you tell anyone out there who you were, or that you were tied to this place? Nah. No, I've been sticking to first names for a reason. You seem like an okay guy, and the last thing we need is drama out there. 
I've got this little girl to take care of, and... Look, don't make me wrong on this. I don't plan to. Good. Because if this lasts longer than a few days, and you're a detriment to the group, then we'd have a problem. I hear you. I'll just keep it to myself. Thank you very much. Thanks. Don't worry about it. Right, can I keep that photo? How's your finger? It's okay. Thanks for fixing it. I'm You're gonna welcome. keep looking around. Okay. Right, so I've... Oh, I've got the photo. Right, brilliant. Wanna head back into the drugstore with me? Okay. Lee? Yeah? You're not bad, right? I, uh... Why are you asking me that? That lady said you killed someone. Was that because he was one of the things trying to eat you? It's complicated. Sometimes things happen or you do things and you can't explain them. Oh, honest. Let's uh, head back to the others. Outside. You better let me do it Let's now. Let's have a look around. Okay. We should think about searching that guy across the street. Maybe he has them, but who knows if he actually worked here? Me. Hey, man, what are you doing? We can't even think about going out there unless the keys are out what there. What the sure. hell, man? That guy oh. over there has the keys. How can you be sure? I found this in the office. That boy in the photo worked here. The keys being on him is as good a bet as we can make. Yeah, I agree. Just need to figure out how to get out there and get them. It wouldn't need long, right? Nah, just a few seconds. Maybe there's a way to distract them and buy you some time. A brick. I can't reach that brick. Those TVs are on, and I'm sure they're making a lot of noise behind that glass. Open sesame. That won't work. I was <laughs> kidding. It's universal, but not that universal. I know, Doc. Right, so open it. Awesome. Now to distract those things. Carefully. I can't reach that brick. Right, open it. Then. Now I can reach the brick. Please don't say you can't reach it now. Don't watch TV, guys. Yeah, <laughs> dum dums. Now's the time. Looks like a brilliant show you're watching, guys. Be careful. Keep an eye out, will you? I don't know what happened to mom and dad. 
I don't think he kind of agrees with him. Did you find them yet? Give me a second. I got to do this now, man. I got to do this. Uh, it's hard, I know. There you go, that's how you kill them. That means they're all going to come. As I said, no, you are not allowed entry. It's like drunk people on a night in it. That one, that one when last orders are being called. It's like, no, I want another drink. No. Oh, 
ground. Sorry, but you trusted me. Which is why I'm helping you. Oh my god. Let's go! They got done. They... They... You gotta move! Nope. I want to say run. <laughs> you absolute asshole, aren't you? I'm not letting somebody else get eaten today. Thank you. Especially Thank you, Kenny. Friend. Nice bonfire. Sounds brutal. Hey, Glenn. With uncountable severe emergencies in all counties, Georgia's cities and their current level of disaster are as follows. Atlanta, stage nine catastrophe. Augusta, stage I think I need to go. To Atlanta? Yeah. I got friends there. And I just can't stay here knowing that they could be trapped in that city. Sounds like nobody knows what's happening there. When we left a few days ago, could have gone either way. I gotta take my chances. Okay. You gotta do what you gotta do. And I gotta do this. I respect that. You guys be safe. We'll try. You'll be safe as well. Shame you don't have any pizza with that. <laughs> then it's a pizza cat. Hey, kid. Close call back there. Thanks for picking me up. No problem. We have to take care of each other. Yeah, we do. Hey, about Clementine. Yeah? Earlier I said there's some stuff out there that might screw up a precious little girl like her. You did. Well, I still think that's true. But after what I saw today, I think between you taking care of her and her taking care of herself, you two are going to be just fine. Thanks. Thank you, Kenny. You got it. Can he hear duck? Here we 
with you. How you doing, Carly? I'm okay. You know, considering. I do, yeah. I can't stop thinking about Doug. We couldn't have saved him, could we? I don't think so. It happened pretty fast. I know it's stupid. We just met. And he was such a... It's just that... I think that I liked him. <laughs> I'm sorry, Carl. It's okay. Thanks, though. There's been a lot of death in the past few days. Anyway, I'd rather be alone, I think. I understand. Wait, Lee? What is it? How did you choose? We both needed you. You picked me. I was gonna help you both. But you helped me first. Yeah, yep. I did. I just wish we both could have made it, you know? Me too, Carly. <laughs> Don't cast it down. Don't cast it down. Super Dinosaur was toast, but you know what? He wasn't. Oh, and then... Hey, Duck, uh, you want to cool it for a minute? <laughs> okay, sorry. I'm sorry, there's uh, not a lot of kids here. No, it's not that. It's... I got grabbed again. I was there, though. I fell, and my walkie-talkie broke. Glenn had the other one. Oh, I'm sorry. Thanks. I know I need to be tough. I'm just sad. I know it doesn't make any sense, but it's how I used to talk to my mom and dad. And now they're gone. It's gone. Maybe we can find you another one. I'll just keep this one, I guess. Lee, come here for a second. Hmm. Let me go deal with this. <laughs> oh man, Clementine, another one. <laughs> what do you want? You like my daughter? Yeah, she's great. Well, stay the fuck away from her. Mm, or charming. what? Or, uh, everyone will know that you, Lee Everett, are a killer. And you were before it was something you had to do to stay alive. I know who you are. And I don't give a shit about what happens to you. But if anything happens to my daughter or that little girl you've got with you, <laughs> you watch your ass. Charming. Thank you. Hey, Lee, do you have a second? My dad would be dead if it weren't for you. That guy Doug is dead because of me. You can't be like that. You're only one man. I don't know. We're lucky to have you. So what's gonna happen? I hope that's the sound of us winning this thing. Me too. This motor end's pretty damn defendable. We block off the entrances with some cars, keep someone on watch. We could stay here until the military rolls through. I actually agree with that plan. Me too. We got beds, we got water, and most importantly, we got light. There are worse places to call home. Yeah, you're right. You know, guys, I think it's going to be okay. Me too. Well, so that is all we have for episode one. I thought when the music picked up then it was going to... Um, we'll have a preview next time. I thought we'd be fine if we survived the walkers. Never expected they'd starve us out. I want you to have this, okay? In case you or Clementine starts feeling weak. You don't owe me anything, Carly. How are you doing, Clementine? I'm really hungry, Lee. We gotta get food, Lee. Soon. Howdy. I'm Andrew St. John. We're from the St. John Dairy. It's beautiful. I never did thank you for saving Duck from the Walkers back at Herschel's farm. Something's coming, Lee. There's gonna be a war. The Walkers don't worry me as much as the bandits. You fuck with us! Now we're gonna take what we want! There's too many of them! Please! 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 Uh. 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 
Wow, so next episode certainly looks like a treat anyway. So, yes, that does it for episode one. I hope you've all enjoyed the story so far. And um, we will continue it, not next week because I'm on holiday. It'll be the week after when it'll continue now. So let us know if you're enjoying it so far and that you wanted me to carry on with it. And I'll happily carry on with it. Because I do enjoy playing this game anyway. I just hope you all enjoy it too. Um, remember to like, comment and subscribe. And I'll... Well, actually before we've seen. Let's see how well we did for our choices. So, honesty. We was... 54% of us were honest. 30% would only save... Chose duck. Oh, right. Okay. Loyalty. 54% again. Gave Iron the gun. Yeah, we um, 52% of us refused, and 48% chose chose Carly. Right, so two of them were was low to the public, but rest of them we were above. So all in all, I can't complain. Plus, it's how we play anyway, so we can't really do all else. But um, yeah, remember to like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you in another video. Bye.